Hi everyone, welcome back to another Mumsy's reaction video. <laughs> Today she's going to be reacting to the video of Prashant and I going to Golconda Fort. Ready? Yes. Cheers. Cheers. Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Authentic India. Today I'm in Hyderabad. And I'm with Prashant and his family again. Yes, nice to see you again. Very nice to see you too. Yes. We're going to have a breakfast and then we're going to go to a palace. Chao Mahal Palace. Chao Mahal Palace. Yes. Chow Mahal and Palace. And then we have to plan to visit uh, Golconda Fort too. Let's do this, everyone. Yes. <laughs> Don't blame him. <laughs> Go be cooked. More food. Oh, she's such she's, a good cook. She spoiled you. And here's the mixed bed she's going to make oh, after yeah. that. And then this is Besam. Besam Namak. And Pani. Pani. Chili, salt, water, water. Yeah. <laughs> Not your favorite. <laughs> she adds a lot more ingredients. Yeah. Mumsy's doesn't it's like the smell of heme. <laughs> than, than I have. Yeah. So hers is going to be very tasty. Oh, and it was. Really well. yeah. Tasty, tasty. I like her style too and how she did it. She yeah. Just put she the just veggie puts right, right into, into the, the batter. How easy is that? I don't know if I can find all the green chilies, but Yeah, they're fairly spicy. But good. <laughs> yeah, for you. <laughs> her bangles going. I know, and she's yeah, them. they're pretty. Special sauce. <laughs> ketchup. Who's to say that looks so like ketchup? So we have the gobi pakoras. Yeah. Those are right I now we have gobi pakora. pakora. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Delicious, really nice flavors, really nice flavors, yeah, she puts far more ingredients into her besan mixture than, yeah. than I have been using. It makes the batter yeah. super tasty. I can really, really taste the difference with the additional spices and it's very nice. Yeah. And then we also, also ready. <laughs> We also have some of the Maggie tomato sauce that we're using. Maggie. Mm. Popular brand. You've heard of the Maggie yes. noodles. Yes. So this would also be a very typical breakfast to do that. Yeah. But it, uh, it can uh, make the random any Anytime. In India. Oh, yeah. The regular plate pot. It's not easy eating with one hand and holding the camera out at a distance. No. <laughs> not easy at all. Didn't have that camera. 
He's yeah. a good cameraman. Oh good. So if I take bites it wouldn't be so bad instead of shoving it in my mouth like you do. Happy taste buds. You just took a huge bite and he just <laughs> took a bite bite. So to finish off our breakfast, For sure. we're having civilized. a cup of sake. So I would have taken sato. a bite. Liquid sato. Liquid sato. This is to aid in digestion. So it has sorghum. Yeah. Uh, Jira, Chana, Chana and uh, Heem, yeah. mm. salt, mm. little bit, a little bit of salt. Mm. Let's give it a shot. Cheers. Cheers. Salt's not good. It's nice. It's nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's thick. very thick. It's almost like uh, lassi. It's thick. Mm. Lassi. Yeah. yeah the, the consistency. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Mm. I would I would equate it to like almost a soup stock or a soup in yeah. in, oh, in really? America. Oh really? Uh -huh. uh, we uh, we eat this by adding sugar. Ah. Uh, okay. So water dal ke or mar ke ghee even even mila ghee ghee and sugar. Uh -huh. Mm. Ghee and sugar makes everything good, right? And mm. another combination. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's it's. Mommy, mommy, get it. She's saying yes. you would like. <laughs> yes, I would like the yeah. sugar. It, yeah, it's a very sweeter. savory drink. Yeah. yeah, it's not a sweet drink. Not this so one, much the this ghee, one is savory. It's, yeah. it's very the delicious. sweeter version. Yeah. He asked that, uh, can you bring this all the way to America? I don't know. Maybe maybe a little bit of it. Bring what? The powder I will mixture neither confirm nor it. deny that I'll be traveling oh. with that to America. Which you didn't <laughs> In case there's any U.S. Customs watching. No, <laughs> Customs is so strict that <laughs> if you have some powder. Uh, can yeah. you buy this powder in USA? Maybe. Maybe at an Indian market. Indian market. Um, yeah, maybe. Mm. Um, I haven't looked. Well, to our help. No. Can you check? You didn't even look in Belgies. All right, we just finished up breakfast. Now we're on our way to the mm. palace. He's waving yes. to you. We're going to be taking Ola, right? Yeah. Auto rickshaw. Yeah, just one minute away from us. Okay, let's do it. Yes. <laughs> Prashant's it looks like Ola sent us the wrong vehicle. That would be hard, right? going through Hyderabad. I don't journey started right now. Yeah. Good journey. <laughs> we had fun taking the auto rickshaws. <laughs> Oops. Friday. Guess what day today? <laughs> <laughs> it's Friday. <laughs> Closed. We run into what that quite a bit. It not only happens in America to us, but now it's also happening to us in India. The palace is closed on Fridays, so we'll find something else to do. That looked. Oh, that was an awesome restaurant, but. We didn't eat anything just because we oh, mean, you just, just had breakfast. Yeah. yeah. But these guys were so neat. I had to just stop and chat with them and take a video. Super friendly. So 
unfortunately, the palace was closed, but fortunately for us, the Taj restaurant. I believe was open. the one in the white uh, shirt was the Met owner all these wonderful of the people restaurant. making okay. some nice puri, and it looks like chan chan and all. Yeah, it's uh, looks awesome. Hopefully, hopefully we can come back here and try some of the food. <laughs> So all the young kids wanted to show off their skills. Yeah. <laughs> they, had to, <laughs> they had to get in on making <laughs> some of the puri. <laughs> or patura. They're good. See how fast yeah. he was? <laughs> Very good. Friday morning, everyone I think was getting ready to go into the mosque because oh. Friday, Friday is their holy so day for their prayers. To eat over at the Taj restaurant, we're still <laughs> completely full for breakfast. But what we are going to do is we're going to stop at the chop corner and we're going to get an order of pani puri to split. And uh, I'm going to get a lime juice. Try that for the first time in India. Or will I? <laughs> it on the menu. <laughs> so this was the first Pani Puri in India. That was good too. Super good. Different because of the doll. It was hot. The doll was oh. hot. Yeah, it's super tasty. First time having Pani Puri in India. Yeah, just Are you that. ready? You I'm just ready. said that. <laughs> Let's do this. Yes. Not messing around. Let's get in there. <laughs> Making a mess too. Are you a dunker or are you a spooner? <laughs> spooner. <laughs> and cheers. 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 Mm. Was it spicy? Well, no. To you. Wow. It's very tasty though. What that is good. Yeah. The doll. I thought the doll was well, the tastiest like part, but have you taken ever for shot like the pond? Do you think Caldera water? No. No. Is that what this reminds you of zero water? Caldera. Powder the caldera powder. Mixing. No, with the with the doll being hot, it really different from any of the other uh, Pani Puris that I've had in yeah, America. Because cool. mm -hmm. usually the... I would the probably like it because remember yeah, or the, the, a few times the, I had it and the, I, it was just such yeah. a contrast. So I spice, wish it was warmer. This is spiced. It's spiced very nicely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 But that doll is so tasty. I think this was the only restaurant where we had Pani Puri that actually had doll also. The other were the Alu or mm -hmm. the Chana. Mm -hmm. Really taste the coriander yeah. in there. Oh. Yeah. 
very nice. Mm. What you didn't see was the little gal behind the curtain. But this is different Poor gal was like, I think feeling design. trapped in there because we had the camera pointing directly at it. She was in the back trying to make things. Because <laughs> there were actually two people working in the restaurant. <laughs> such a neat snack too. Yeah. It is a neat snack. Yeah, in America I've had the honey glory maybe four times I think. We didn't even and put this on this the list when we did the food the tournament. In America. No. Yeah. We could almost just do a chop tournament. Yeah, we could. And have all our different chops. Yeah, maybe it would go a lot. <laughs> Smoother with the comments. No. <laughs> they would still be all over the place. Would mommy like it or not? Yeah. Yes. I think she would like this one too. Is it with the coriander in it? Yeah. It was tasty. Next time, mommy, with you. Okay. We all try it with you. Next okay. Time in UP. Yeah. In UP. Yes. I'm poor. Yes. In my hometown. Yes. Definitely. Mm -hmm. So the final party for Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> That was just the right amount too, because we had walked around enough to walk breakfast off. Mm -hmm. I probably was coming full. <laughs> so unfortunately, they don't have any lime juice here. They have the sign out, just don't have the product. So <laughs> we'll have to go find one out on a cart. There, there's been carts all over the city that we've seen this morning. It's so, so funny when you're we'll in auto rickshaw, you see them there. everywhere. And then when we get off, and there's like, nothing. <laughs> nowhere to be found. <laughs> <laughs> But they had a stand right, a stand at, the, right there. at the fort, the entrance to the fort. Nice. Not exactly the same as the other stands that we'd seen, but this was, this yeah. was good. This was just way too much sugar for me. Yeah. Because this is sugar, sugar water that oh, they're pouring in. Oh my gosh. That might even be too much for me. In the Philippines and some of the other stands that I saw, it was literally just lime, lime. and a little bit of water to cut yeah. it down a little bit. Yeah, yeah that does look like a lot of sugar. Super sweet. What do you think? Is this the first time trying? No, many times. You've had many times? Yeah. This is one of my favorite drinks also. That and coconut. Yeah. Nice taste. Nice taste. So if yeah. you couldn't tell, <laughs> it is a camera. we've made our way over to Golconda <laughs> Fort. It's one of the most historic places in Hyderabad. And we're going to wait to meet up with another viewer and then we're going to go in and see the fort. Or will we? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that right, Amar? <laughs> so it seems like today is going to be one of those days. I, I just got a, a message from Amar. He's not going to be able to meet us at the fort, but uh, hopefully we'll be able to link up a little bit later mm -hmm. on. Maybe this evening, we'll see. So for the fort, yeah, we it's did. just going to be Prashant and myself touring the fort. And he made up for it. He brought a friend. <laughs> a thief. 
super cool guys. Isn't that just an absolutely gorgeous fort? Ah. One of the interesting the facts that I learned was that Hyderabad was actually the diamond capital of the world. Yeah. So all the diamonds produced in the world at one point in time were produced right here in Hyderabad. Yeah. Is it the 1500s? Mm -hmm. oh. That we uh, so you show me So this was a very important now place South to Africa. be. Now it's South Africa. Now we're going to go Diamond. check it out. I'm not a huge gem fan. But just stunningly beautiful. Look at that. Yeah, it is. I think it was something like 15,000 people used to live hmm. in here. Yeah, I was just trying to imagine what it would have been like when this was yeah. operational. Whenever we go to historical areas, that's exactly what I try and do. So there's a total of 720 steps to the top. Yeah. We're just about there. Yeah. A little, little bit to go. <laughs> yeah, we almost done half. Yeah. Let's finish it up. Yeah. Gorgeous view of the entire city mm -hmm. also. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the temple is on the other side of town and you can almost see the two. I mean you have a well, view there you go, everyone. from the temple or from the fort. Tour of Hyderabad from right yeah. here. You can see most of the city. Yeah. Very nice. Let's climb all the way up and see the other side of the city. Yeah. They wouldn't allow me to put the external microphone on the camera. Mm. They wouldn't let me use the tripod. They just the camera only. Wow. What this was like when it was actually a functional fort. How many people they had here? How many animals and all of their weapon systems and ammunition? Had to have literally had thousands of people here. Very impressive sight. Very impressive. A lot of Indian tourists visiting there too. Oh yeah. Not many foreigners. I think maybe one or two foreigners and all the rest were Indian tourists. Hmm. I would go. I, that's what I want to go do. So I look on all the historical monuments and forts and whatever. Yeah, temples. Oh. All the cultural. Next thing. Food is one thing, but I can't eat all day, so <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather explore. <laughs> oh, and the birds here too were awesome. Like here, here's one soaring. Oh yeah. I could just sit there and watch the birds soar all day long. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, how neat is that? Yeah, that's really... Mm. Wow. breakfast over at the house. My mother is such a wonderful cook. Oh, so they thought it was going to be like a professional televised thing with the external mic and the wind muff. Your dad is yeah. always a, a joy to be with. He's always very happy and smiling. Yeah. Yeah. You make them surprised. That they is are very happy. Hardly a professional yeah. camera. <laughs> it's a palace. tourist the camera. <laughs> But we went and we saw the, the two restaurants, we went to the Taj restaurant and the Chachana. Yeah. 
had the Pani Puri, that was excellent. Very different from the Pani Puri I've had in America. Very delicious. And then we got to visit this spectacular fort. Wow, how amazing is it? It's just mind blowing to think what it would have been like in its heyday when it was in full use. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely spectacular. So thank you so much everyone for watching. We greatly appreciate it. And please um, help us help, uh, to grow this YouTube channel. And uh, if you like the video, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe the channel and be the part of this the YouTube channel. Kid. <laughs> yeah, come, come join us. Like, okay. Follow us from Charminar. It's been such a blast. We've had so much fun. And, and Mumsies and I just want to meet as many of you as we possibly can. Yeah. Thanks so much. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Bye. Yeah, I mean, we could go to that fort, you know, a couple dozen times and still not see everything. That's how big it is. Yeah, I would love to see it. You could spend days walking through there. It was really neat. They have uh, a communications system set up in just the shape of the fort. There's a place where you could stand in one spot and then be a few hundred meters away and you could clap your hands and you could like hear perfectly. Wow. Where, you know. Yeah. Where they would place sentries, I'm sure, and that was right, their, their right. means of communicating. Wow. That's Very awesome. Very neat. Yeah. 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 The people before us who were our builders and... They knew what they were doing. They did. They just... That's what I love about history, to think how they come up with all this out of nothing. You know, we have, we have everything, you know, already done. That's a neat thing. Yes. I'm sure they had lots of elephants back there, too, back oh, in the day. Sure. <laughs> I want to see some. Yeah. Next time. Yes, next time. Next, first time for me, next time for you. <laughs> <laughs> well, any other thoughts? or? Nope, it was good. Good. Very good. Well, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. We greatly appreciate it. We really do. Till next time. Bye. Bye.